Hi, this video is from HainaLabs.com, a user experience design company. We have seen that they, they are a lot of WordPress blogs and WordPress websites. Now in this video we are going to show how to transfer a WordPress site or a blog from one hosting to another hosting. So let's start doing it. Now we will show how we are going to transfer hainalabs.com from Znet to Bluehost. So let's do it for you. First thing we can do is we have to go and create a directory in which we want to transfer our new site to do this we have to go to domain manager of Bluehost where we are trying to transfer the site now as you can see we have got different websites here the page is taking a little bit time to get reloaded okay meanwhile okay so this is the domain manager of Bluehost and you can see here there is an add-on domain called 27expo.com 27 Expo is a website to share your social media pages like LinkedIn, Facebook, Twitter pages so uh, okay uh, I will just let's focus uh, on the problem here of transferring the domain okay. to do this thing to con to create an add-on domain we have to click on assign a domain to your cPanel account registered domain transfer a new domain to your account so it's assign a domain to your cPanel account third option we have to take meanwhile we need our Znet servers the point here Znet because this pointing is important um, from Znet end so we have to log in here on our Znet India account my account login and you can see your domains these are the domains okay and you can see the name servers these are the two name servers here we have to enter our bluehost name server so the domain name is xyenalabs.com let it verify okay the domain is verified now we have the name servers we need to point these name servers so to change these name servers name server 1 and here is name server 2 we need to change this okay and save changes now 
you can refresh this page and you will see that <coughs> that the name server pointing is done see here it's done so what type of domain we want we want an add-on domain or parked one so we'll select an add-on domain and we have to create a directory so we'll write a directory name hina labs subdomain to be hyena same thing hina labs and we'll say add on domains. Uh oh, okay, hyena.com. Let's go and check whether it's done or not. Usually it happens. It's not there. <coughs> so we have to click here. Go on. Try E and A and A D S dot com let it verify it is verifying the domain and please point these two these two things copy name symbol one This is the name server two. Do <laughs> host. Okay. To say save changes. Okay. Let's go and see my domains mana labs see here ns2 dot bluehost and ns1 i think name sub one it should be one and it should be two let us save changes okay my domains and here ns2 ok labs add on domains and labs add domain add the domain they need the ETP code okay it may take few hours for this okay let us renew it Okay. Meanwhile, we can. Meanwhile, you have to back up the files. So this is the C panel of the website which we are trying to transfer. So we will back up, download it. We're downloading the backup directory
is the EPP code. We are going to add add it. Add the subdomain. Yes, it is being downloaded. As you can see, we are getting it downloaded here. Now we can see that we are assigning the domain, and here this file is being downloaded here. Okay, so similarly, we have to download the mysql database of hanalabs.com